Hallie said that she had a bad dream last night, and something super bad happened to me. Hi, sissy. Hey, go check my horoscope in the paper and tell me what it says. Fine. Hey, Carly, are you going to the party tonight? I don't think you should. Something bad could happen. Of course I'm going. Bad things don't happen to me. Well, I don't know. I've never believed in superstition or anything, but some pretty freaky stuff has been going on. The food in the cafeteria was actually good today. That's just coincidence. Why are you doubting me? Stuff like that isn't just a coincidence. If I don't go, I'll look super lame. I might as well go and see what happens. What did my horoscope say? It said you should stay in tonight because you're going to have bad luck. Uh, go away. I'm tougher than that. All this magic mumbo jumbo stuff is ridiculous. I'm going out. You're being silly. Blame it on me. Say we're busy doing something else. We'll send Mary Ann to tell him you're sick. Fine. She can say I'm sick. I won't go. Hey, Debbie. Hey, what's up? Are you ready to go to the party? Oh, I'm not going. I don't really feel like it. Say she's sick. I'm not gonna lie, I just don't want to go to that lame party. At least give me a good reason. If I don't have a reason, I'll get laughed at. They don't need a reason. Just tell them I'm not coming. Between you and me, Callie had this dream where all the water fountains at school ran from my blood and everyone drank it. No, you've got it all wrong. That just means you're the life of the school and everyone wants to be like you. Oh, well that makes sense. You know, if you don't go to this party, no one will vote for you for prom queen. Do you want everyone to think that Callie tells you what to do? Callie, you're so stupid. I'm embarrassed if you can listen to you. You know what? I'm going to that party, so go get me a dress. See, Paula's even here to come pick me up. Hey, what's up? Hey guys, you're up late. Brianna, shouldn't you be in bed? What time is it? It's only 8 o'clock. Hey Tara, sorry I'm making you guys late. It's taking me so long to get ready. I just wanted to say to you guys though, that even if this party makes me prom queen, I will still remember you guys. Well, let's be your friends too. Psych! Okay, let's go grab a soda and then we'll leave. I like you, Carly, just not enough. Yo, Carly, your friends aren't who they say they are. Watch your back. They don't really want you to be prom queen. Your enemy is uh, closer than you think. From A. Soon as she leaves, I'll send this. If she doesn't read it, it'll be too late. People are just too jealous of her. Hey you, go to the party. Hurry, why are you still here? Why am I going to the party? I could tell you, but I'm not going to. Just do what I say. Oh. Why did Carly tell me your secret? I'm so bad at keeping them. Why are you still here? What do I do? Go to the party, come back, and nothing else? Meet the castle and Brianna, and watch out for Carly. Do you hear a noise? No, I don't hear anything. Come in. Where have you been? My house. What time is it? It's 9 o'clock. Do you need a watch? Has Carly left for the party yet? Not yet. I haven't seen her leave. I'm going to watch her now. Do you have something to tell her? Yes, I do. I need to warn her so she can check herself before she wrecks herself. Why? Is something bad going to happen? I don't know for sure, but something could happen. I'm going to wait for her in a dark alley until I can talk to her in private. Alright, I'll go home. I'm really afraid for Brianna. I hope it goes well. Brianna is asking a favor of me, and Carly won't give in. Oh, I feel so sick. Hurry, Lucy. Go and tell me. Ha <laughs> ha